Okay, so I've been repairing another Cosmo tonight for someone who sent their dead unit to me. I've just put a brand new battery in it. And it occurred to me that um, there's not many people know about the actual diagnostics or debug menu that's available on the robot. Um, Anki put it in, I think, in a later patch, um, but it kind of got forgotten about. Uh, all you need to do is when your robot's on the cradle, you raise and lower the arms once, and then you lower and raise the head uh, once or twice. That will bring up the special debug menu uh, that not many people have seen, I don't think. Not many people are talking about it online. But there's actually quite a lot of useful information you can get from these menus. Um, you would use the robot's treads, so his wheels basically act as like a scroller to move the cursor down, and his arms then act as like a yeah, an enter key. So you can get various diagnostic information about the robot. Um, you can see what the accelerometers do, and you can connect to his sensors. You can see what charges in the battery. You can see how much charge is coming through to the battery from the uh, the cradle that it's when you put it down. There's quite a lot of useful information, and you can also do a factory reset on the device as well. Um, so if if you've got any kind of problems with your Cosmo that you know these guys are getting on uh, in years now, if you've got any kind of uh, functionality issues and you don't think it's related to the battery, you could always select that factory reset option uh, and just wipe it clean and start again from day one. Um, there's plenty of information here. Uh, please do leave any comments if you've uh, got any quick tips yourself. Um, you know we're trying our best here to keep these guys going. Uh, hopefully this isn't the end for Cosmo, but uh, I'll speak to you again soon.